The unmanned aerial vehicle, which is one of the best strategic game changers, is the war's next frontier. Currently India is reportedly buying 30 MQ-9B Predator armed drones that were produced in the US. There are six various variants of the aircraft depending on their operational capabilities, however, only a small number of UAVs created in the USA are offered for export to other nations. The MQ-9B is one of those UAVs. This aircraft assists in locating the enemy's coordinates and keeps an eye on the activity from a height of 50,000 feet. Making a choice and choosing a target for the weapons is one of the crucial elements. The use of unmanned aerial vehicles in recent wars in Russia and Ukraine was crucial for remotely striking enemy targets. Since these aircraft are unmanned, they can go and hit their targets at extremely high altitudes. Beyond any reasonable expectations, American technology can undoubtedly aid India against its nearby adversaries. The anticipated $3 billion purchase of 30 drones is intended to increase India's total surveillance capabilities along the line of actual control with China and in the Indian Ocean. Notably, the MQ-9B drone is a variation of the MQ-9 Reaper which is said to have fired a modified Hellfire missile last month that took out Al-Qaeda commander Ayman al-Zawahiri in the center of Kabul. It has a turboprop engine that can run on several missions, and it can also be flown independently and remotely. This technology debuted in 2001. The MQ-9 is available in two versions, one designed for surveillance and the other with seven external hardpoints for weapon storage and firing. The US and Royal Air Force gave it the moniker Reaper, although it is now often used to refer to any Predator B that is armed. It has triple redundant flight control, which means that critical systems have been duplicated for usage in case of failure. One of the best strategies for lowering the likelihood of a significant issue affecting is redundancy and have a more effective flight control system. It is capable of working with both the Ku-band satellite communication network and the C-band line of site data connection control. Its operational availability is 90%. It can also be self-deployed or transported by a cargo plane like a C-130 transporter. Featuring unmatched operational flexibility, MQ-9A has an endurance of over 27 hours, speeds of 444 km per hour, can operate up to 50,000 feet, and has a 1746 kg payload capacity that includes 1361 kg of external stores. The aircraft carries 500% more payload and has 9 times the horsepower. It provides a long endurance persistent surveillance strike capability for the warfighter. Let us know in the comments what you think of the MQ-9 Reaper for India Defense. If you liked our video please subscribe to our channel.